Hello everyone, sorry I forgot to make an intro for this video, but this is me making my Poison Ivy Halloween costume. Hope you enjoy it. So, okay painting. <laughs> so I'm gonna go to the fabric store, but I also probably need to go to the thrift store just to see if I can find anything like the tights. And what was another thing? A head for my wig, because I don't have one and I feel like it'd be a lot easier to style if I have like one of those little heads to put it on. I'm sure there's one at the thrift store. They always have creepy shit like that there. So we'll check for that. And then um, like a sheer black top already done would be really freaking helpful. Because Lord knows it would be really hard to make. I can make it, but it would just be so much easier if that already existed. And then I can like attach it to like the bodysuit part that I make. And hopefully it's not too slutty like <laughs> put a lot of embroidery and stuff as you saw in my sketch to cover up the details and that's kind of the plan that's kind of where we're at so really quickly thrift store oh also spirit gum is that what it's called it's like the glue for the wig slash like it's just for prosthetics, like makeup and stuff, but I'll be using it to attach my wig. And then the wig's supposed to come on Wednesday, which is really exciting because that's such fast shipping. Shout out Amazon Prime. No, I'm just kidding. Fuck you, Jeff Bezos. But also, that's really fast and I'm excited <laughs> to try it. Okay. Let's go shopping. with these tights was I'm gonna put these tights on and then put some black tights over top of them so it looks like I'm wearing black tights but then I have just like green skin underneath and I think this is looking really good and very successful okay I'm just gonna do it Okay, so I took my fabric and it's very stretchy so I added these stretchy top and shorts over top of it that fit me well and decided to basically trace over them and like cut around them to hopefully have some pieces of fabric that are going to fit me. Now the problem is, is these two pieces are way stretchier than the fabric that I got so when I sewed it all up it was actually very very tight but uh, I just kind of made it work anyway. So. Now, as you know, I'm folding the pieces um, right sides together because that's how you sew things, typically. And I'm using a zigzag stitch because I don't have a serger and a zigzag stitch is going to make sure that um, the stretchy fabric won't rip. This looks so funny right now. <laughs> I love it. She's sticking needles in her skin. I'm still slightly too attached to this bra to cut off the straps. But you know what? The straps might help keep it up. So maybe I'll just keep them. Okay. <gasps> oh, I could like embroider them and cover them. With okay. I'm getting ahead of myself. So as you can see here, I took this old bra and then started um, sewing my garment to it basically to hold everything up and give it some structure and as you could hear in the last clip I was originally planning on having this being strapless but knowing me that's just not gonna work so having the bra straps attached still is gonna be very helpful for this. Oh my god I'm so excited! Got the wig! Of course I had to try it on to make sure it's looking cute and it's all working. And Where'd then we also went for a little walk with a uh, little dude. So. Yeah, good boy! Why are you slowing down? Okay, so I'm still working on the Halloween costume. It's not done yet, but I don't know what to do because it's taking so long. No, actually it's going pretty well, but I'm trying to add all this little bits because I want it to look like hers. I don't know if I'm filming that right. So, but I don't really have the right colors. I don't know. We'll see what happens. And she's got little beads and stuff on her, so I'm doing that too. 
Let's see what happens. Christian costume update. He's gonna be the Riddler. I don't know if I told you guys that yet. So we have this really gorgeous top from the thrift store, obviously. Everything's from the thrift store. And it's Calvin Klein. Just bougie. The only thing is he's got a thickums neck. Look at this boy. It's thick. Look at that neck. So the top button doesn't do up as with every shirt he ever tries to wear. So I don't know if he's gonna fix that. I think I think it's fine. I don't think that matters, but he thinks it matters. So <laughs> anyway, then we have this tie, fabulous, also from the thrift store. Guys, just, just get what you need from the thrift store. And then this amazing green trench coat. And we're gonna add some question marks to it so that he can be the Riddler. So that'll be really awesome. Oh, and, and, the, and the crappy bowler hat. Oh, and then he's got this really crappy bowler hat also from the thrift store. That'll be perfect. So the reason why we're doing it this way is because I don't have time to help him with his costume this year. So he's really got to take the reins on this one because I'm slow on, on mine. This video is already late and I, I don't know. I don't know what's happening. I don't know why my costume's not done yet. This is chaos. It's like October 24th. That's a problem. Anyways, that's, that's, a problem. that's a problem. We do this every year. That's why, that's why we want to value this. <laughs> that's why we want to value this. We're trying to get it done. Anyway, okay, see you guys next update. Okay, so it's Saturday, which means I have to get the costume done for today. And there's still a lot to do. And I still, so um, from what you guys saw last time, I took off all the little like stringy things because it just like wasn't really working with the type of fabric I had. It wasn't really looking right. So we're just going for adding a bunch of these leaves with like the little beads and stuff but i'm thinking of maybe mixing these leaves that i'm making with some fake leaves from michael's to kind of add a little bit more texture and add a little bit more difference with them and make them pop a little bit more but that has to be done for tonight because we have a party that we're going to tonight and i also have this top Woo for underneath and I'm thinking of adding some of the, more of those little leaves that I was making to the ends of the hands. So let's see how far we get today. Also, I got my nails done to go with the costume, which is really fun. And then <laughs> another thing I was gonna tell you guys is this thread that I'm using, this thread that I'm using is like stretchy thread, but it gets tangled like that so easily because it's, I guess because it's stretchy, so that's, um, so it's really hard to use like a longer piece and hand sew with it, but I need it to be a bit stretchy on these things that I'm sewing because I don't want them to break off, like especially with all the beads falling everywhere, that would be a shit show. So <laughs> that's kind of where we're at. Wow, the more I work on this, the more I realize I left it all to the last minute, so I also have to do... Uh, The sleeve. She's sticking oh, fucking stab me. <laughs> Not the sleeves, but the what do they call these? Straps. The straps, because they're like that other green color from the bra underneath. So I'm covering them with this fabric that I've used for the rest of it. And oh, it's just putting the leaves on takes so long, so also working on that. Yeah. I've got a crow. Okay, they didn't have the right leaves there. So I have a couple options. I either go pick some off like the plants out here or I walk all the way to Michael's because I don't have a car today. So I guess that's the move. I just wanted to show you guys this because it's really fascinating and it was on my walk. These are salmon and they're trying to swim upstream and they're struggling and it's so, oh, I just want to catch one with my bare hands. Like how tempting. Okay, I made it home. Oh my God, it was such a intense walk and it was raining like crazy the whole time. So now I also have to work on Christian's costume. So here's his hat before. I'm gonna add his colors to it and then I'm also gonna add the question mark to the front because I think I told you guys already he's the Riddler. Okay, let's do it. Ah, it's gotta be done tonight. It's already like 1.45. Oh, lordy lord, and I'm not even close to done my costume. She's just sitting there. Oh God.
Done. Oh my God, it's looking so good. Yes, I'm so excited. I'm glad I grabbed these leaves. And I'm loving the way they're looking mixed with the other little leaves I made, so let's keep gluing. Now I know the leaves look really realistic, but I promise you these are the ones from Michael's. I didn't just go pick them off the side of the road, although that would be probably more sustainable. Anyway, um, I am, as you can see, hot gluing these things on because we're running out of time here. And you know what? I think that's, well, I thought that would work the best for them to stay on and to be easy and to be fast. And we really got her done. So shout out to this glue gun that I just bought at Michael's. Um, I think it'll be part of my journey on YouTube probably for a very long time. So very grateful for that. But yeah, watch me struggle and burn myself and all that jazz. <laughs> Guys, should I add like a coochie? leaf <laughs> I don't know I think it's kind of fun well I don't know maybe I'll leave it to the end we'll see what Christian thinks also with the way I'm placing the leaves I'm gonna try to add as much volume as I can to like the booby area and the butt area so that it makes my waist really snatched I don't know if that's gonna <laughs> work but in theory it should it's looking so good so far. I love how I'm incorporating the um, little fabric leaves that I made with these plastic leaves and how they're kind of like working together with the, with the beads. I think it's looking really cool. Okay, I'm really happy with how this has turned out. It's looking really freaking good. Time to style the wig. This is where the makeup's at so far. <laughs> Looks crazy, but I'm just outlining where I'm gonna fill everything in. And then I also braided my hair. So if I can schmack it up in that white cap, really nice and s like slicked back and smooth. So there's no weird alien bump at the back of my head. It's like an hour later. <gasps> it looks so fucking snatched on camera. <laughs> and we're not even done. I was so excited. Dude, I just, I love doing my makeup. It's just, oh my God. Did I even show you guys the finished wig yet? Oh my gosh, we're gonna look so pretty together. Anyways, I'm so stoked for Christian to get home too and like see everything I've done because I did his costume. Sorry, I'm just like staring at how beautiful my fucking eyeballs look. And my eyes look more green now. They're blue, but like with the green makeup, they look very green. So yeah, I can't wait till Christian gets home to see everything I did. Cause I did a lot today. A lot more progress was made today. And look at these freaking nails. Shit. <laughs> it's so dark. 